What is good everybody and welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today I have some more WWE figure custom belts for you guys. As you know, I believe it was last week sometime, maybe on Thursday or Wednesday, I cannot remember. But I showed you guys some custom WWE figure belts that I was working on for Undisputed Brotherhood. I covered both main titles on each brand and then one of the uh, mid cards on each brand. And today I have four more titles, five more titles to show you. We got both sets of tag team championships and then one more mid-card title for one of his brands. I'm still working on one of his titles and I actually need your guys help for it. I'm gonna need you to help me out with the design of it. Um, I will show you the base of it. I will just need like a complete rehaul of imagination so I can get that uh, title belt complete. So with that being said guys let's go ahead and get into these custom belts. Alright guys, first up we have the Hardcore Championship right here, and it is exclusive to Raw, I believe. The base is obviously the Cruiserweight Championship, as you can tell, and all I did was take this thing and just beat it up. I got some dry brush black on there, some dry brush red, as you can see on the main plate right there. I took a Dremel to it, chipped off some of the plating, um, messed up some of the strap there, as you can see. There's some rips in the strap, there's some rips up on the, uh, the side plates. I did some scratches, like you can't even see Cruiserweight no more. I did plan on coming in here like sideways and putting UWF on it. I just haven't gotten the thick enough paint yet. I'm going to do that with gold or um, I may do just like the hardcore title. Put some tape on there and put UWF or something to uh, throw it off. But I really do like this championship. It's obviously just a beat up cruiserweight title but I think it works great for a hardcore championship and I hope that uh, TJ likes it as well. Nothing on the back. I'll probably add some black in there to um, you know complete the entire belt. But this is the first championship we have right here. It is the hardcore title. Up next, we have the UWF Tag Team Championships exclusive to Raw right here. It is obviously the Big Eagle WWF title from the Attitude Era right here. And I really do like the way this championship came out. As you can see, I painted over all of the blue with some red. And then I added some red streaks right here. Covered the WWE logo with a U. And that's pretty much it. Added some silver details to the side plates and the main plate there. And I really do like the way this championship came out. Um, here's the other one, obviously. Tried to make them as uniform and close to each other as possible. And I think it worked out well. Very excited with these. They look a lot better than I thought they were going to turn out like. So I'm very excited to see that they worked out great. And I know that Undisputed is going to love these. Um, I sent him a little tease picture of it and he said he liked them. So I'm very glad to see. Um, but I want to know what you guys think of this. Also let me know down in the comment section below what you think of the Hardcore Championship. But there's one set of tags. Let's look at the SmackDown Tag Team Championships. And here are the SmackDown World Tag Team Championships. So you have the Raw Tag Team Championships and then the World Tag Team Championships over on SmackDown. As you can see, we use the Attitude Era slash Ruthless Aggression beginning of that time. Um, tag Team Championships as the base. I added some silver to the uh, side plates and the main plate there. Covered up the main um, logo here in the middle that said World on it with a blue uh, sort of paint. Came back, painted the countries and stuff in black, and then finished it off with a UWF over the top, and I think it worked out beautifully. I really like the contrast between the Raw and SmackDown. So let's take a look at both of them side by side, as you see here. So it's really cool. On his brand, he's going to sort of have it like the uh, Ruthless Aggression era, where you had the red tag titles and then the blue tag titles. But they're not soaked like today's championships. They actually have some contrast of gold and silver in there. So I'm totally loving the both designs of the uh, tag team championships. But now I want to show you the title that I'm struggling with. So here is the final belt that I'm sort of having trouble with. It is the big gold as the base. We replaced the side plates with um, some old school Intercontinental championship side plates because the other one with the big gold title were really long and it looked like one solid gold bar. It looked kind of weird. So any ideas for this championship, guys, we are open to hear them. We know what the title is going to be called. It's going to be the Triangle Championship. It's going to sort of be like a triple threat championship where like three guys are feuding over it all the time, most likely. I think that's what we're going for with this one. But I am sort of struggling with the design for it. I don't know exactly how I want to do it, but I do like this belt since it's so like unique and stuff. But again, we are having a difficult time sort of figuring out the design of it. So if you can help me out, guys, hit me up in the DMs. And if you have an idea for it, send me a concept drawing or something like that. And if it works out, it works out I will definitely give you a shout out. So definitely hit me up. Let me know down in the comment section below what you think of it. And uh, yeah. But yeah, guys, that is all the custom WWE figure belts I have for you today. Let me know down in the comments section below what you think of all of them. I'm really digging the tag belts again. The hardcore belt could probably use a little bit more work, a little bit, a few more details or something like that to make it a little bit different. I'm digging the triangle championship. I just got to uh, figure out, you know, what design I want to do on it. Again, let me down. Let me know in my DMs if you have any ideas. 
Hit me up in the comment section below. Leave a like on this video. Try to get this thing to 150 likes. Subscribe for more epic WWE and WWE figure related videos. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.